Hi guys, today I'd like to share with you my review of Highland Woods RV Resort and Breezy Hill RV Resort. It's a two-in-one special. Now the reason I'm reviewing both resorts at the same time is that they're sister properties. In fact, I had my reservations over at Highland Woods, but I had to register next door at Breezy Hill. Now Highland Woods actually used to be a trailer park, so they did something very interesting with the layout here. As you can see, the rigs are sort of staggered, so one is up front and then your neighbors are further back. In a way, this is really cool because you don't have a neighbor right on top of you. and Instead, you just park your cars next to each other in front of the rig that's further back. The only downside to this is that your hookups are on the wrong side and they're way in the back. Uh, so if your sewer hookups are near the front, bring all your extensions. So this is my neighbor's setup. They're from Quebec, as are about 90% of the folks here. It turns out the Canadians are a very unique RV culture. They really, really like their enclosed awnings and tents, and they love having uh, social gatherings outside. There are tons of activities next door at Breezy Hill. I just don't know what they are. Even the receptionists at the check-in desk are French. I can't even win at bingo in English. Think I can win at it in French? Probably not. But you know, I didn't find the language barrier to be that much of a problem because it seems like one out of four of these Canadians uh, at least speak some English, so you always have a translator nearby. It seems the French Canadians bring their own sports with them as well. Now, don't get me wrong, I've seen shuffleboard before, uh, but there were a whole slew of sports here that I had never seen. Take bocce ball, for instance. But there is one sport here at Breezy Hill that needed no explanation, pickleball. I just didn't necessarily know what the score was, that's all. Now you may already know about my complex rating system. Uh, it's a simple, would I come back here? And I would definitely come back to Highland Woods or Breezy Hill. Now this is an Encore Park, it's part of the Trails Collection. So if you have a Thousand Trails membership and you do, and you do the $300 add-on, uh, this is free. Okay, so you can stay here for up to two weeks. If you'd like more information on these memberships, uh, please check out the description page and I'll have some uh, links to other videos at the end of this one uh, to tell you all about Thousand Trails and the Trails Collection. If this information has been helpful to you, do me a big favor and give me a big thumbs up. That really helps my channel grow. And also subscribe. Okay, that's all I got for now. Safe travels and I'll see you next time.